Hello, I'm going to show you how to make this beautiful little palm palm rug uh, using yarn. So what I started doing is wrapping it around my hands. Um, depending on the size of the yarn, this one was kind of thick so I wrapped it about 40 to 45 times. If it's thinner, I just wrap it probably be about 55 times depending on the thickness of it and how full I want my rug to look. And this was my first time doing this and it was just some random project I tried to do and use some yarn that I already had at home. So as you can see my assistant back there is helping me count and keep up. So once I finished wrapping it, I cut the thread um, where I stopped and then I cut an additional piece to wrap around it and as you can see I take that piece and wrap it twice and I just make it pretty snug nothing fancy and then I cut that to about the length of the pe the ball that I have then what I go in with my scissors and I just cut those pieces open individually sometimes some I do together, but either way, you should end up with a little fluffy ball. And I do this, I can't, I, I did probably about 60 of them, I want to say. But yeah, I use a Dollar Tree rug that I found, um, just because it wasn't that expensive. And I basically arranged them up there however I saw fit. Then I took it over to my little station. I pulled my glue gun out because I didn't want to do it the way that everybody else was doing it by tying it. Um, hopefully I won't regret it later. <laughs> anyway, yeah. So I basically took the palms and I smoothed them out to push everything on one side. And I add a nice generous amount of circle of glue to the rug. And I placed them down up there and left them to dry. I didn't touch them in between the process because if I do, it'll stop it from drying the way I want it to. So I just pretty much let them, I did it and let it sit there and moved on. And to make sure they're all done, well, I, what I did was I kind of held the rug up. And that will basically show you whatever one you didn't do. But what I will be doing is adding... Um, some kind of adhesive to the bottom of this rug if I decide to use it on a flat surface if I use it on a carpet it should be fine the way it is and I basically continue to do this the entire uh, for the whole perimeter of the rug and yeah that's it got my tester there and she really liked it <laughs> 